And only on 7 News, a small Colorado town considering a bold move, putting a bounty on drones, even issuing hunting licenses to shoot them down. 7 News reporter Amanda Koss talking to the man behind the ordinance and town leaders who see dollar signs. About 60 miles east of Denver, a town easily missed in the blink of an eye. Dirt Trail was like a hustling, bustling place 100 years ago, but uh, you know, not so much now. You're looking at this small town's biggest claim to fame. It's the site for the world's very first rodeo. Now this town is looking to start another first right here on these grounds, the first drone hunt. And I would like to be known for first place in America to have a drone hunting license. Philip Steele drafted a town ordinance providing unmanned aerial vehicle hunting licenses and bounties. Wouldn't that be a federal offense? I'm going to shoot it down, ordinance or no. Have you ever seen a drone flying over your town? No, this is, this is very, a very symbolic ordinance. The fact that this be, is being done by a tiny little town of about 500 people. Under the ordinance, a $25 license would buy 21 and up permission to aim at unmanned aerial vehicles, but only with a shotgun, 12 gauge or smaller, pointed to the sky. Shooting down drones with a shotgun, is that even possible? No, it's not possible. Even still, there's a bounty. Deer Trail would pay licensed shooters $25 for identifiable parts of a drone and 100 for a whole or nearly intact one. You guys don't intend on having to pay any of that out? No, we don't intend on paying on that out. Unless we get lucky. I mean, we got to keep a little petty cash just in case somebody does cash this on. The town clerk, board trustee, and mayor see potential to cash in on the novelty. If passed, these rodeo grounds could be the site for drone days. It's a potential fun moneymaker. Drone hunting days, exactly. You know, like a clay, like uh, shooting clay pigeons and stuff, but we'll call it drone practice. To him, it's, it's a novelty, yes. Uh, to me, I'm serious. But in Deer Trail, bounty hunting drones is still up in the air. Is that something you would like for this town to be known for? Well, I don't know. I haven't made my decision yet. Amanda Cost, 7 News. And the Deer Trail Board of Trustees will vote on the drone hunting ordinance August 6th. And the organizer tells 7 News he's already collected enough signatures to put the measure on the ballot for the next election.